We have a goal for auto sequence start. Discovery's four redundant computers have assumed. T minus 23 seconds and counting. The SRB nozzle profile. T minus 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10. We're goal for main engine start. 7, 6, start. 3, 2, 1. Zero, and liftoff! Liftoff! Americans return to space as Discovery clears the tower. Roger roll, Discovery. Crew confirms roll program, Houston now controlling. Three engines at 104%. Three good APUs, three good fuel cells. Standing by to begin throttle down to 65%. Throttling down now to maintain uh, a certain speed as the spacecraft passes through max Q. Three engines at 65% now. Ending by to see engines begin to throttle back up at about 59 seconds. One minute, velocity 2300 feet per second, altitude 5.9 nautical miles, downrange distance 3 nautical miles. Discovery, go at throttle up. Roger. Discovery giving a go at throttle up, 3 engines at 104%, velocity 3200 feet per second, altitude 10.8 nautical miles, downrange distance 8 nautical miles. Five seconds from solid rocket booster separation. One minute, 45 seconds. Three engines at 104 percent. Velocity 4,800 feet per second. Altitude 20 nautical miles. Downrange distance 19 nautical miles. Standing by for solid rocket booster separation. Solid rocket boosters have separated. Two minutes, 20 seconds. Three engines still running, 104%. 5,600 feet per second velocity, 31.8 nautical miles. Altitude, downrange distance, 38 nautical miles. Three APUs still running at normal speed. Three good fuel cells. Some call-ups here shortly from the Capcom about the capability to reach transatlantic sites. Velocity 6,200 feet per second, altitude 41 nautical miles, downrange distance 60 nautical miles. indicating can't Discovery may, may be able to uh, achieve a transatlantic abort at Moroni if that were to become necessary. Return status and mission control positions all report go. Three engines still 104 percent. Velocity 7600 feet per second. Altitude 53 nautical miles. Downrange distance 107 nautical miles.